Marquette County has been preparing for this upcoming weekend for months. That is right, Steve. It's the annual No Cayman on Ski Marathon, but this year there are some changes to the ski race. TV6's Eric DeBroca has details on how this will affect the skiers. This weekend, the No Cayman on Ski Marathon is celebrating its 20th birthday. We have special uh, legacy skier gifts for our 20-year skiers, and these are skiers that have competed with us uh, each year of the 20 years of the existence of the No Cayman on Ski Marathon. This year, NTN is expecting nearly 1,200 skiers from across the country to compete in the scenic trails Marquette County has to offer. There's a lot of rolling hills and uh, large vistas and some views of Lake Superior and um, a lot of wooded pines and overall just a beautiful trail. With this kind of volume on the trails, the groomers have been working many hours each day. There's people spread out throughout the whole trail working on problem areas, slushy ponds, any little spot that could cause an issue. Everyone's out there working extra hard to take care of uh, saplings and things like that that, that would hinder uh, a skier's experience. There are, however, some changes skiers and spectators need to be aware of this year. We have a new start area in the full marathon in Ishpeming at Alqual Recreation Area. We have a 4K addition to the start of the historical marathon race. In addition to this, there have been some added distance to the trails this year. One other difference is that skiers won't finish at the dome, but rather a couple miles away at the log yard. Transportation will be provided to and from the start and finish line all day Saturday. From Marquette, Eric DeBroca, TV6 News.